you know how annoying it is if you're a Sims 3 player. Every time you get a NVIDIA update, you have to go in and reset ah, your in-game so settings. Cool. This is just a little video, and I'm going to show you an easier way to do that. So what you want to do is navigate to your Sims 3 user file. So documents, electronic arts, Sims 3, and you want to find the options.ine file here. And so you just want to back that up. So you can just drag that and drop it on your desktop. And then you can update your graphic card. Once you're finished uh, updating it, I, I just did. Um, every time I turn around, there's a new update with NVIDIA. So it does get annoying. Anyways, after you've finished updating it, you want to start up your game and then you can just start it up to the menu and quit. That's all you have to do. And then come down here to the start here and click on run. And then you just want to type in DXDIAG and click OK. You just want to click on your main monitor, which is this should be display one. And way over here on the right, you'll see version. And then at the end, there's four digits there. And those ones are the ones you need. All you want to do is open up that backup file and then you want to find a last device. So you can just click on control F here and type that in and then search it and it'll come up. This number here, you want to put that at the end here, which I've already done. And then click on save, close everything out, bring up your user file again, and then just drag and drop that options into there, replace it, and your settings are back to where they were to begin with. And that's it. That's how easy it is. So it's a little bit of an easier way than having to go in and change it manually every single time. So hopefully that helps. Anyways, have a good day, guys. Thanks for watching.